Hey everybody, Dr. Rhett here, and we are live with more Zero Time Dilemma. We left off C Team, Dunzo, Q Team, also Dunzo. Now we're on to the D, -D, 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 -D Team. Of course, I figured we should we should start these people. I have no idea any of them. I remember dude was like an old man teleported from the future. Super smart chick, but I feel we should start their story with some character development. And this is looking like another don't press the acid shower button one. So, of course, we're going to do that one. So, as you can imagine, this will be a short one. But thank you so much for watching. It's been a fun. But let's get introduced to a few more characters that we don't know too well. So, first come, first saved. D. What's her name? Diana? Damn. Won't even budge. Not even an inch, girl. Does that mean it's locked? Probably. Yeah, yeah. Seems that way. So that means we're trapped, huh? A little teeny bit trapped. Where are we? The decontamination room. That's how it's labeled on the map. There are showers in here? You need to wash all contaminants off after you return from outside. Yeah, makes sense. Well, in the case of nuclear war, of course. There's not much Which going means outside. There are two in that exits case. heading to the surface. Here and the X door in the lounge. Mm -hmm. Don't just drop a paper or something. Right. It looks like there's a hall to an elevator outside. I don't see how they're connected on the map, but it must be there. Okay, then let's escape through that door. How exactly do you propose that? It looks like it's been welded shut. Maybe it'll open if we push that yellow button over there. Let's not. You not just hear that it's welded shut. Then what exactly is it for? Should we try pushing it? It's clearly suspect. Better not. Right. 1809. Not too late. You know, the anesthetic was injected after Something? the vote. Maybe. Around. Yeah. 609. 1330. It's been a while. So we've been asleep for almost four and a half hours. It's a good, strong um, power nap. That might not be true. Right. Zero did say. Once 90 minutes are up, an injector in your brace will activate. Then they shot of anesthetic and memory wiping agent. agent. Mm -hmm. That means we could have woken up and fallen asleep several times since then. Very well could have happened, girl. We just don't remember any of it. Not a bit. I wonder what the results of the voting are. It's highly unlikely that C Team was able to survive. Why? You even have to ask? Why? Diana voted against the plan on the note and chose C Team. What? No, I didn't. Well, wait, hold up. What are you saying? I thought Diana voted for Q Team. I thought I voted for Isn't Q Team right? too. I'm sorry. I. Well, I. I don't really remember. It's been a while. I what? voted for Q Team. How is that possible? How could you forget? After the vote at 1330, he told us we wouldn't be injected with the amnesia meds. Right, I remember it exactly. Diana had chosen to vote for Q Team. Yeah. No! I know for sure that she definitely voted for C Team. No, I voted Nonsense. for Q Team. You must be out of it. You're the one out of it, you senile old fart. Rude. No. He's a giant of a man. Wait. Don't tell me. Jumped? Jumped? Is this more of her seeing or people seeing other histories or whatever? What Sigma was going on about back in DCOM? Well, it's all true. Oh, when he was saying mankind would be destroyed? What did he mean exactly? Do you mind explaining? Even if I did, I don't think you'd believe me. I mean, I would believe it's you, and that's what matters. You won't even understand. I probably won't you understand. See, the things Sigma and I have been through are, um, complicated and mysterious. Ooh. Does that mean your consciousness came from the future? 2074? Just a few years ahead. Yes, but that's not exactly right. Sigma and I both originated from the current world of 2028. Okay. Our consciousnesses were sparked by a specific event into jumping forward to 2074. We returned to April 2029, 
where we lived 45 years normally through time. Okay, he went there, back, came back, and then... consciousnesses were booted to the past again. Okay. And essentially ended up at this point in time. Christmas That's, uh, of thing. 2028. It's always Christmas, right? Why? I don't know. See, you don't understand, do you? It doesn't have to make sense. You only need to believe us. Sure, I'll that believe what you. happens in the future? Correct. I have to know then. Why was mankind destroyed? It's not exactly destroyed. It isn't as if there aren't any survivors left. But a large number are... Yes, the dead number, six billion. Oh, is that all? I don't know what our it's population totals would be like there. Six. Was that the suicide the virus that affects the human the brain. suicide one it spread quickly worldwide and humanity began heading to extinction the one that what's her face the stole location a syringe the virus up. originated at was the experimental facility decom that Ooh. was what we were told anyway some of the information appears to be incorrect though we've seen some here how so this is just a guess but I think radical six wasn't leaked from decom I've got a feeling it came from the shelter instead. The chick stole it. Then we believed it all I don't trust her anymore. So we infiltrated the facility as subjects to prevent the release of the virus. With Akane's help. Akane? She's the leader of a secret group called Crash Keys that wants to save the world. What? Using the organization's assets, we hacked the admin server and altered the original subject list and data. I see. I mean, it all seems so fake. I could hardly keep up with all of it. We're not lying. It's true. Don't really have anything to gain from lying right now, right, though. Then. So, I believe him. I'd like to go back for a second. Fi, you said you jumped earlier, right? Yeah. Does that mean... Yeah, we almost pushed that button earlier, All so, yeah. Woo! I'm so glad. I can't say this is an ideal situation for many of us involved. It appears that none of you fully grasp the essence of this game. Think back on the rules you were told. That wouldn't be so bad if you just stopped making us kill each other, though, right? A single action from you may result in your escape from the depths. What must you do? It's simple. I shall show you. We're not pushing this button. The other two teams are listening to a message just like this one. Uh huh. In their wards, decontamination room. That can't be. The construction of all of them are the same. A yellow button exists on the wall in each. Pressing it activates the showers in the other wards, and they will rain down a solution of hydrogen fluoride. Mm, dissolved what? metal, acid. Hydrophoric acid! It's not only acidic enough to melt a body, but it he knows what's up. Glass and iron. Explaining what would happen if you were under it seems unnecessary. Uh huh. Using it will kill the other teams, and you will obtain the needed X passes to escape. I have one final thing. No, Kane's super smart. I'm learning the that. Gets the worm. Except As when she went murdery. Have a nap. You guys, you're not gonna be shocked here. We're not pressing the button. Like, no, we're definitely not doing that. Wait, don't! I'm doing it to protect you two. Fuck what? off. It's not to escape. Of course, I don't want to kill the other teams. But if we don't act, we're the ones who die. No, no one's gonna push certain. it. 
no one pushes it before three minutes are up. But if we wait, all three teams will be killed. The acid will melt even our bones, and all that's left will wash down the drain. Is that how you want to reunite? To hug and cry together in the drain? <laughs> that's awfully morbid. See or hold them. <laughs> wait, wait, Sigma! Please calm down! How could I possibly do that? So well, those eyebrows, though. Pushing the button right now as we speak. Just listen, please. Zero did say that we had three minutes, but he never said what would happen once the time limit ended. She's right. Three minutes is just a space of time. There's still a chance nothing will happen after the deadline is over. That's what I figured. It right. must mean that we are being tested to see how much we all trust. Please believe, Sigma. Trust the other teams. I mean, I trust the other teams. I'm not hitting this button. We're just going to casually stare at it. The little circle's going to pop up to make our choice. Time to decide. And we're just going to look at it for nine whole seconds. So you know what? It's a nice looking button, but nah, we're good. It's not happening. We're fine. We're not hitting this button. Mm -mm. No way, no how, no siree. Easy as that, right, guys? Don't wait it out. Everything's going to be okay for us. Nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. Yeah. We're fine. See? I told you, didn't I? None of the others push the button. So that's proof that the other teams can be trusted to cooperate. It seems there may be a misunderstanding, so I shall clear it up for you. I never said the showers would activate as soon as the button was pressed. Which means... You have to learn whether the button has been activated by someone or not. What? And when? After then you guys have a cycle. sweet, sweet nap. <clears throat> I get it now. Don't tell me we'll be asleep when... Now, it is time for you to sleep. That's a good thing. You want to be asleep for the acid potentially eating your body. That you will have no memory of these past nine minutes. Pleasant dreams. Night, night. And no one pushed that button, folks. Woo-wee. Awesome, and that's the end of that one, so thank you so much for watching some Zero Time Dilemma, but for now, that'll be all. So yeah, of course, leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching and joining the series. I mean, we're going to keep going, of course. There'll be more tomorrow. You, you just got to wait your sweet time. It'll be up at, uh, like, 4 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. But for now, I'm Dr. Ed. I'll catch you all next time. Bye for now, everybody!